<laughs> What's up YouTube? Devin and I are over here at the car, parked in the shade, because Starbucks parking lot is jam-packed. And you can't even park at Taco Bell, they got towing signs everywhere. Anyways, we just grabbed some cloud macchiatos. We got a cinnamon and a caramel. and a caramel cloud macchiato. Ten dollars we ain't gonna never get back. We're gonna go hit some ponds right now. We're gonna head up Preston and hit a pond in Salina that we fished before. It's very deep. It's gonna be cool to try and maybe throw some of these MTB Pro Box deep diving cranks. So follow us along. I'm gonna switch you over to the GoPro when we get there. I just wanted to do the intro in here in the shade. It's a cool 82 degrees today. A little overcast, but let's be honest, it feels pretty hot. Alright y'all, we're just pulling up. We're off of uh, County Road 94, if I'm not mistaken, in Salina. Whip off Preston to the right and the pond's right here. Real close by. Parked in the park, right next to it. Uh, it's just a short stroll on over here. Dang, those are like decent sized minnows. Holy live bait. How are you doing? Were they biting earlier? No, uh, we had a few little ones in the moss up here. Okay. Worms and stuff. Yes, sir. Under, but no. Whoa, CS6 is that what we're looking there. for. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna set the stuff down in the shade, guys, and I think we're just gonna walk this bank here and try this. Everything looks good, but I know it's real deep out here. There might be some big mamas hanging out. Pretty mossy, so a crank might be a little rough. A deep diver, like I was thinking, might not fly here. Okay, here we go. This spot could definitely hold some bass right here. The wind's blowing this direction. Bait fish getting pushed up again, guys. You hear me talk about it in a lot of the videos, but the wind blown corners are often where you want to target. I'm just trying to figure out where they're hiding because they, they might be along the edge here. It's not extremely shallow, so they could be just down there hanging out. Close to 10 minutes, throwing on the bottom. I'm gonna throw something moving real quick, see what happens. All right, that was about 10 minutes with the rip knocker. Let's see if they want a Senko. Oh, bite. Hold on, let me cast out here again. We haven't caught anything yet, so we're gonna go try the other side of the pond. Just gotta make it across this little creek here. Oh, bites. More bites. <laughs> Y'all see that? Gotta be a little bluegill, right? She's got one. She. Oh, first fish at this pond, I think ever. We haven't caught a fish here yet, and it's a big old fat mama. Check out that little chunky belly. All right, I'm gonna let her go so she can go. I didn't want to shower. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one fish down. Let's get some more. Well, we tried quite a few things. Quite a bit of stuff on the bottom. I resorted to a swim jig and all the mossy madness and she's the only one that got a fish. I would say it was a, at least a two and a half. But uh, yeah, so we're off, to the, we're off to the next joint, she says. We're gonna go, actually we're gonna stop at Grimaldi's and grab a pizza real quick, I think. Why not, ooh! <laughs> and then we're gonna go to another spot. Where's the other one? It's a secret. Oh, the other one's a secret. We're gonna go to the secret spot next. said that there was some other people that they had talked to that had caught a few and one of them was like a six pounder.
weather changed a little bit after pizza, I think this might conclude today's vlog. Devin smoked today with the only fish, two and a half pounder. One, so, one fish. Uh, yeah, we're back at the shops at Waters Creek, and I think we're just gonna leave the car in the garage while we let this potential hail pass. A couple friends have said it's been hailing on them. Maybe grab a cheesecake from the Cheesecake Factory with coffee nah. for dessert. This is insane, y'all. Hail just ripped through here. There's hail all over the highway. The rooftops are white. The hail is like, certain pieces are freaking huge. Insane, look at this. It was like 85 degrees earlier and we were talking about how hot it was. This is crazy. Every, it's like snow covered Texas. The car's sliding. Oh my gosh, cars are sliding. There's definitely an accident. That's why this is insane. Y'all, was this weather change up not the craziest thing you have seen? Well, anyways, we made it to the next spot. No need for the sunglasses anymore. Maybe cast from here with the wacky rig once or twice. Let it drift back in the wind up to these rocks. Look at how crazy this is. I don't know how the storm affected this area. If it really hit here like crazy, they could be stirred up and on the move right now with the overcast sky and the wind, or they could be out deep and hiding and be very finicky. And we're about to find out. How you doing? Good. Uh, we just got here, <laughs> but we shall see. <laughs> That's what I hear. Yeah, I was catching some on the treble hook, so I switched over to something a little different. We'll see what happens. Yeah, it was crazy. We were driving through Allen, and there was uh, just hail all over the highway. No way. Whew. That's crazy. We just had big bites. I think the trench hog might have gotten messed up because it feels heavy. So I'm thinking uh, it ripped it off the hook a little bit. Yep. Wow. Good hits. <laughs> Little one. Oh, he got the trench hog though. Oh! Gotcha. Dang, he's feisty. All right, y'all, got us in a little pre and post thunderstorm fishing action today. <laughs> she got one, I got one. That's gonna finish this video out. It is now getting dark, except for all the lightning. But uh, <laughs> anyways, we will now catch you guys on the next video. Peace out. <gasps>